throughout the years, uh, I've helped recruits, I've mentored them, coached them up in the process uh, throughout the whole college recruiting process. So there's three kinds of recruits that I've worked with. Uh, you have some that they just know their list. They know this is the list of schools that they want to go to. And then you have some that they think they know, but they really don't know. Because once they go through the process, it all changes. Then you have some that they, they just don't know. And it's okay not to know. That's what the process is about. Um, so I'll give you some examples. Like the ones that know that they have a list. So maybe it's uh, maybe mom went to an Ivy League school, dad went to an Ivy League school, and the sister went to an Ivy League school. So uh, this family that I work with, they, they give me four Ivy League schools. So my job in that situation is to um, connect them. So to get the, um, get the recruit to communicate with the coach. Um, I'll give you an example of, of something that did happen uh, like that. Is I was working with the family and we had some Ivy League schools and uh, they, they became a client and the father says, hey, what are we going to do now? Are we going to do a video? I said, no, we're not going to do a video. I'm going to contact Coach X on her cell phone and give her two weekends and you and your daughter are going to go up there and they're going to play a match at a club nearby because she can't try out on campus. So they, they try out, um, not try out, but the coach watches the player play near the university. And this was up north. And, uh, and it worked out. And then I always coach the parents. So I said, uh, make sure that you go to Starbucks while, while this is going on. And, uh, or Dunkin' Donuts or Dunkin'. So go there. So now the coach can have one-on-one -on -one with the player. And after the player plays a set or two, I encourage... Uh, um, encourage him in this recruiting process to ask the coach, hey, coach, where do I fit in within your program? And then that just conversation just kind of goes and goes. So, so it's not only a great opportunity to connect with the coach, but the, the, for the recruiting purposes, but it's also, it's a great opportunity for the, for the recruit to see what kind of feedback the coach is going to give them. So, that is for the people who, when they know, you know, I'm usually helping them uh, gain communication and, 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 um, and connecting. Now you have some that they think they know, but they don't know. So, for example, I was working with a player and, um, and I asked the player, I said, hey, what's your dream school? And she said, hey, my dream school is X. And I said, well, if I call the coach on this dream school, and get you a spot within the program, and this particular person wasn't necessarily looking for a scholarship, is um, if I get you this opportunity, this spot, will you take this spot right now to your dream school? And um, she said, no, I, I want to look at other schools. And then um, she kind of pointed it out. She goes, hey, I guess that's not my dream school. I can, uh, it must not be. So she went through the recruiting process and ended up going to another school that was very good. She had a great experience. But in that case, she kind of thought she knew, but she didn't really know. And then you have um, recruits, families, parents, you know, it's all one, right? Um, they don't know and they admit that they don't know because when you're going through the recruiting process, what is it that you're looking for? Are you looking for a school that... Um, uh, how academically selective, what's the geographical location, hot, cold, what do you want your athletic experience to be like, do you want to compete for a conference championship, do you want to play high in the lineup, what kind of coach do you want, do you want like a Attila the Hun kind of coach or do you want someone that's a little bit more nurturing. So in that case, when I'm, when I'm working with, um, you know, the, those kinds of players that we're, we're we're developing a list of schools based upon the feedback that I'm getting from the recruit. So um, over my 25 years of college coaching, um, the uh, founding UTR and, and uh, coaching up players and being involved in the college world and consulting with college coaches um, about budgets and fundraising and, and social media and so forth, 
uh, it's been a great joy to work in, in, in the college, and I love um, coaching up kids to um, recruits in order for them to find schools that's the best fit for them. Um, however, uh, you know, I, 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 don't, I don't coach anymore in that aspect, so um, that means I don't have to worry about shoes and scholarships and strings and, and so forth. But I do enjoy coaching them up, so if I can be of any help with you guys in the recruiting process, all my contact information is listed below.